Yo, I go by the name Henshaw, aka Henry Cozy. Um, I'm an artist, rapper from Camden in London. Yeah, man. Um, I don't know if I could, but if I had to choose a few words, it would be something different. Uh, someone I, I want to work with Skepta one day for sure. Um, I want to work with artists like Mike Skinner, Slow Attire, all these, all these different UK artists that I mess with because um, I'm, I'm very heavily influenced by the UK sound. Oh yeah, 100% because I mean, at, at this moment in time, I don't know if there's really like an audience for my sort of sound hugely anywhere else apart from the UK. Like there is other consumers, but my sound is, is hugely UK like influenced or therefore. I don't know if I can say what, how, what is this, is this, is how are we keeping it PG or, or what? Cause just music, music, music and weed man, music and weed, literally. Just writing every day, trying to anyway, because I try to write as much as I can without doing myself in, but yeah, just a lot of music and yeah, a lot of other things. Yeah, so with McCartney, I remember I was, I was on my own, I was in my room. And I started writing it one day when I was just pissed off, like I'd, I'd been struggling with writer's block, like I, I do a lot, but like, yeah, just sort of, I heard the beat and I had to use it. It was, it was um, my boy Chase, who produces all my stuff, got a beat from his YouTube. I was like, bro, you're gonna have to, you're gonna have to reserve this one for me because I wanna do my thing on it, did my thing on it. And it turned out to be sick, man. Like, recorded the video. And people was waiting on that tune before it came out. People was asking me and asking me. So, yeah, man, McCartney holds a special place in my heart. So, yeah, man. Definitely, it's made, like, because I've just sort of been alone with my thoughts. So it's given me time to, like, reflect and, and like, pick out things that I might want to change or improve, for example. So, yeah. Social media is a sticky one because like this, like everyone is on social media. Your nan's on social media now, did you get it? So like, there's, 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 I think for especially young people, there's so much there to just pick at your brain and like, just, just fuck with you because you, you're comparing, you're constantly like comparing yourself to other people, other people's followers, looks, whatever. You're just, you're just constantly like comparing yourself. And I feel like, it, it plants a little seed in young people's heads and it just makes, it has a huge part to play in I think a lot of people's anxiety and stresses and whatever. I'm not saying it's the, the, the main cause, but therefore has a part to play, I'd say. Um, well, if you didn't know, I'm part of a group called Love Set. Um, and Love Set is something you haven't really seen before. Like this, you got, you got, you got me who's just, you know what I'm saying? This is me. I'm out here. And then you got, you got. Um, there's metal influences there in, in there from like bad lad. You got the indie sort of vibe coming from V right. And then you got, if you just want a vibe, I'm bounce. You got Zari. Stick it all together. You have Love Set. So it's it's something fresh. And I feel I feel like Love Set will do big things in the next couple of years. So shout out to the gang. And yeah, man, watch out for us. <laughs>